buddy programs can be a bit hit and miss, so we knew that a cross-age buddy program would present us with more opportunities and challenges. Um, we needed to make uh, come, come up with a program that related to Year 1 students and Year 6 students and also the Digital Technologies curriculum. Um, we wanted to go beyond traditional type buddy activities such as buddy reading and um, we needed to make sure that the learning that we were doing was purposeful and meaningful for the children. Uh, we knew that uh, Makerspaces would give us that opportunity for students to uh, collaborate and create, invent and learn together in an engaging and meaningful way. Well Mel and I had, along with some other members of our staff, we had, had attended some really great training and a, there, were, a, there was a lot of it around the Maker movement so we decided to focus mm -hmm. on that. We showed some students a YouTube clip of some current examples of making making musical instruments and we were so excited to see that the kids were really engaged and wanted to make their own versions of it. Um, the room was silent, you could hear, almost see their minds ticking over. We had the students in pairs, one year six and one year one student, and what we really wanted to see was the year sixes challenging themselves whilst the year ones could create and discover with uh, Makey Makey and Scratch. The initial brainstorm and the design was the easy part for us um, because we'd done it before and so had the students. After that stage, the children then had to come to some kind of negotiation about what was their final design would be. Um, I was a little worried at this stage that my year one's voices wouldn't be heard, um, but they were very strong in voicing their opinions and the year sixes were great in accommodating them. The quality of the year sixes questioning skills to their younger buddy were outstanding and they were able to come to a, a, an agreed product. Probably the most challenging part for us when we, is when we came to actually connecting the Makey Makey to their musical instruments. Um, none of us, including Julie and I, had used Makey Makeys before, so it was a learning curve for everyone. Mm. That, that whole process um, of the using of the Scratch programming and the Makey Makey kit was the bit that scared me the most because I had never done it before. Um, and I was expecting my Year 1 students to be able to do it, but the Year 6s were great in supporting them to be able to be successful.